Hello farmers and welcome back to Farming Simulator 2013. Let's play on the MIG map. And I have some happy news for you all. And yeah. That is, I'm going to show you folks in a second here. See, tab here. Oh. Oh, oh well. Maybe we can show here. Yes. As you folks can see. These are bits and bobs from that old weed mod. Yeah, I figured out how to fix that right now actually, right before I start recording. Just got an idea and tried it and it worked. It was something inside the Sega game file since as I said before I updated the map and the version that I used to have and I started the let's play kind of it, he changed something with the weed mod so instead of having a weed mod built in, you can use the multi spray mod if you want the weeds and that meant for all the say games we'll still have that script and newer say games will not and kind of be you know, we'll have something on the ground that we can't do anything with. I even tried to cultivate and everything, you couldn't get rid of it. At least what I had tried and I decided to see if I can get it away and it is gone now and Nothing seems to be broken by me doing anything in the same game, so yeah, I've not done anything like that before. So I'm quite happy. But what we want to do today is to get crack on with the harvest, get to finish the last two fields. I might actually pick up a field. I think I talked about that last time. Can't remember. I think I, I think I did. I checked the prices, so well, I can't remember right now. I can't remember. I checked the prices, but I can't remember the prices. Those. I guess it was that field and that field I wanted to buy. Can't remember right now. Well, we can take a look at that later. Might might ne next episode or later this one. Not too sure. But okay, let's get the C there. Already know what C there I want. Maybe the same um, mod creator has made the map. This is Bulgar. So made the Hosh. SW three thousand five hundred is built for two thousand nine originally. Farming two thousand nine. Do you remember this? Ah, I can't remember if I used it in two thousand nine. The video I'm sure it made it for the farming two thousand nine as well. But I guess as as well though it is a two thousand nine model in real life. Two thousand nine remind me of farming two thousand nine. Do you know this one was in eleven? Do you remember? I guess that 2009 actually stands for uh, the year it was built in real life. You know, <laughs> derp. It's not anything with FS to do. Oh, uh, anyway. So, yeah, let's buy it. There's 21,000 to buy. Self main rig here. 95,000. Uh, 95, no, not, not 95,000. 95 dollars. Ugh. They're pretty strong with me today, and this fellow with twenty eight thousand and thirty eight dollars a day you can pay for that. It's not the big deal. This is the main seeding rig, and this one is for maize, sugar beets, and sunflower. This bit here, this is for lots of the other crops. So yeah, I'm gonna jump into the used to fan. I mean, also with inside it. Wow, <laughs> I'm dropping around today with a commentary. Okay, let's pick up the cedar. I know some sh um, shop areas, I guess. It likes to the cedar likes to move around when it spawns. I do remember in a previous version, I think that Tapas did a spotlight on it. Even the uh, cedar fellow there, the main cedar, even. I've kind of glitched and moved around. I think actually they fell from the sky in the beginning. I think it fixed out. Can't remember. And this is we to lower. There we go. Back up as G J to atta attach it. And just rise it back up. And there we go. And you see, it's a bit special. It accepts. Uh, you can both fill it with the Overloader, yeah, overloader you can fill it with, and I guess with a bucket as well if you want. It's not a big problem. 
and you can feel it from there, see the triggers over here, but it's a bit special for someone that haven't used it before, I can show you folks here so what you want to do you can actually select seeds with the uh, N and we have selected seeds as wheat right now we select the barley, rape, or canola grass and some things that come from now as well, is that how to change it? buy seeds yeah you can change from buying seeds or filling it from a silo it's pretty much up to you there and then you can press R when you figure out what seed type you want and then fill up it has a 3500 liter capacity there we go it's full now so it's quite decent capacity it actually lasts a quite a decent time before it runs out I think he was thinking about that because this map is quite big and yeah so I think the seeds last longer in this valley than it usually does in the cedars but I'm sure it does but you know it's a big map and he I know I've seen screenshot him using this one his own map on this map so no. uh, so I suppose he thought about that okay let's get onto the field here as you've also seen no green things quite happy with fixing that okay and fold it lower fire up this sea there instead of required up to 180 horsepower we have a 188 I think don't know why I moved, the, moved inside here but oh well press, press number 0 I'll put up with headland. Oh no, I only want a 12 meter, I think. Yeah, I think so. See here. Okay, let's hide the worker. See if we will do a good job. So you can run the wheat on this field for this time. See now we need to rotate. I think most of the canola field will be seeding in the wheat, I think. Or barley. Well, since we have wheat inside the tank, we might just run wheat in most fields. Just gonna check him turning around properly down here as well, and then we will let him do what he wants to do with this field. And crack on with what he knows best, I guess. And as well, do you actually have this up here in the corner? Same as the harvester, kind of. This is down here for the harvester that we have. So it's quite nice, you know, you can keep an eye on this level and whatnot of seed. It's very nice of him. I can see I should definitely put up headland. A bit bigger, made a little bit bigger headland, but oh well. I wasn't gonna collide in anything, might do not heal. We'll come back to that. Okay, let's fire up the harvester. We have 124,000 still. That's excellent. Just not drive into the river. Let's attach the header. Open up the grain tank and Line ourselves up. There we go. Come on, there we go. So yeah, we're ready. Crack on with the harvesting again. I think we'll do like two headlands, and then we will hire a worker for this as well. 
So thinking I want to pick up a baler. Really want a new bail a uh, baler now. Said new baler, we don't really have any baler for the while. I want to pick up a baler. I think it's gonna be this a square baler, uh, class quant rent, I think. Class twelve hundred, I think, one thousand two hundred. Yeah, that baler. I think I want to pick up. I think I will buy a new tractor as well. Maybe. Might sell the power, if I'll be honest. I might sell the power tractor. And then pick up a newer, a different tractor. Well, I don't know about newer, but maybe a little bit more powerful tractor. And run the class on that, I think. And we'll have the hard worker running the class combo while I'm bailing. I think that's a good plan for today. I'll see how much money we have left after this harvest. I might pick up a new field. Either that one or the smallest one of these two big um, wheat fields over there. Quite hard to see actually from here but that field we can see in the distance. That's what I want to pick up. He's down. Wow. Not use many seeds. He's still rolling on. Not 100% sure. Might be stuck in a hill. To be honest. Let's fill up the harvester and let him empty, I think. We're gonna take a look what's up with our cedar. Oh no, it's rolling again. Never mind. Oh, the phone is ringing. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Oh well. Second for you folks and uh, I don't know, 15 minutes or something for me. See if I can see the clock has gone a bit further than what it was. So yeah, I know we're back. Continue on the field. Nearly full. Won't, won't get far on the next uh, bit of the headland here. Before we fall. But that's very nice because this was one of the fields I tried to spray to get rid of the weeds. I do remember. That's why this field is sprayed. But it really gives a good yield though. It yields quite good. That's nice. Take out the pipe. And then we're gonna unload. Let this fellow sit and unload. Go and inspect him. Work that the high work has done. Don't know if it, I think it's nearly done though. It's quite close to be done. Seems like it. It's not too much left. Just gonna run over to the JCB. Let's see if we can see a little weight in the front. Because of <laughs> I think I used earlier the barrel weight and that weight was too heavy. I took off the weight and that was too whoa, too light. So that's something I want to say, if you're going to pull this trailer here, you need the weight of this tractor, if you're going to use this tractor here. If not, it will go very very slow when the trailer is full. Just a little tip. Shut it down. Let's go and take a look at the fella here. Oh yeah, he's doing a good good job. It's excellent. Let's 
इसके बाद हम कंटिन्यू कंटिन्यू में हार्वेस्टिंग है लास्ट हेडलैंड आई यूजुअली डू लाइक थ्री हेडलैंड्स बट आई एम गोइंग टू बोर यू फॉर्स विथ थ्री टू शुड बी एनफ इज टेक्निकली इज नथिंग एक्चुअली कैन हिट इज मोस्ट ऑफ थिंग्स अराउंड इट इज क्लिपेबल सो You know, it's not that big of a deal. But two, I, I want two because I don't want him to run into defenses and whatnot. It's a bit unrealistic. So, doing two headlands just to make sure. Very pleased with you. See that we have as well. You know, good job on the field. We're looking forward to try out a new harvester as well. At least get a different one. I don't really know if we can sell this fellow though. This is a multi fruit. I can't remember if the hmm, the John Deere combine. See, oh, I guess I want the S six. Uh, AV, I think, uh, as a camera that I really want to buy because they have very, very nice mods. Big boss modding. As well, they're working on, uh, Julian is working on the same person that, from Big Boss Mod that made the John Deere's. He's working on the Massive Ferguson and the Gleaner, I think it's called. Looking forward to that. It's going to be quite nice. Don't know if they're going to be finished. Um, for this game or for 2015 okay, we have to see be quite interesting what more oh yeah spin tires is soon of soon coming out I see Tomcat playing on it and um, fail race got like um, a product key for the beta version because it's coming out now in two weeks time I guess give or take about two weeks time that game will be released it looks very good versus the tech demo so really think I will be picking that up and um, I'm sure we'll make some videos as well from it because that looks quite good always comment down below if you want me to do a video on spin tires when it comes out Before that, I talked to the farmer with some work, and he said as well, we're going to be starting up cutting grass on the first first cut of silage this year. We're starting up the next week, yeah, next weekend. There we go, next weekend. We try to remove my grass, but anyway, he's gonna start up next weekend. So I might go and take a look at the GoPro for that. Because he might be move, I might be moving some bales for him. No, not done any real life tractor videos. That could be interesting to try out. I think I'll actually leave this for a minute. I'll fix this later, I think, off screen. Yeah, I think so. I'll fix this later, folks. This will be fixed off camera, I think. I'm just gonna, gonna fix off the headland off camera. So I'm gonna bore you folks with that. Okay, let's see if the baler. I was thinking about the claws, right? And of course, we will need the mm, this fellow here as well. Something with boy. Go find the baler. There we go. Claws one thousand two hundred. Yes, I think we'll pick that up. 
so you don't forget I'm gonna buy the bale stacker right now as well there you go and then I think I will sell this fella because if he's a little bit small and you know it's in game so look at the mod you know on the tractor try to think what tractor I want to buy hmm I think I know which one I'm just gonna check the price before I sell that one you see here oh yeah I think I'll pick up this fella here the STR 8150 turbo done a mod spotlight on it very nice mod. There you go. I'm gonna sell the power. Oh, wow. I earned money on that. I think we'll lose any horsepower or anything. That's excellent. Let's do what I always want to do. I like to do, I mean. Take off those mud guards. For reasons that. Tractors I have in real life don't have them, so I'm not used to the motor guards on the front, so and the game doesn't really matter, so no, doesn't throw mud in your face, so yeah. Attach that, go and attach the PTO. Not try this tractor with this baler before. Could be interesting. Don't know how much horsepower the beta requires, but I think this tractor is beefy enough. Yeah. Quite happy about even making money about selling that. I think I've done that on all the tractors we have bought so far made money on selling them because I got bought you know a placing a tractor with one of the ingates that we had and then ending up making money so I don't really know this tractor is even too much older than the other one we sold either so it's stronger and bigger so well maybe not too much bigger but really stronger a little bit What was fully worth it. Let's get the JCB to unload the combine. Check the time on the phone here. Five minutes left. And to unload. Let's start bailing. In the next episode, I guess we will start picking up the bales because that's always fun. So I think I will do that field right there off camera. Um, yeah, I think so. Or maybe not. I don't know. Have to see. Let's open this fella up. And it revs up the engine. Love that feature. As well as a clog meter on it. So better not go too fast, but we can go in this speed, it seems like. Yeah. Seem to work very well. Come on yourself again. Excellent. At least I think we will uh, finish harvesting on this field. Well, at the high work, I mean, finish the harvest and then we'll bail the field off camera. Let's finish bailing. It's going to drop one bale here and then I think it will end off. So it will be a long enough episode, I think. I got some, a few things done today. 
Yeah, we've got one field seeded. Still have to clean up the edges, but oh, really. You clogged on me. So be careful with the corners because it's more. It's a lot more straw in the corners. Makes sense because the common stops and clean itself out. I think that was the bale, and yeah. Just gonna shut, don't really shut him down. But, anyways, I see you folks soon, and have a nice day, and bye.